Yes. Okay, sir. I was born. I was born in Nigeria. I was born in Nigeria and I've been a lecturer for over two decades now. And I have watched virtually what I can call the hypocrisy that is going on in Nigeria. How Nigerian government, or let me use Nigeria, has actually left those who are very, very important to the country. How they keep victimizing people who are so important. I have been following the case of uh, Chief Sunday Bo, not even knowing that I will come to meet him for quite some time, because I just developed interest, just as I said, my mother is a Yoruba person, but I am not a Yoruba, but I was brought up, schooled, everything in the, in the Yoruba land. So, when I saw somebody who actually developed interest in assisting the Yoruba, taking Yoruba out of slavery, sorry sir, permit me to use that word, out of slavery, out of slavery, we have been humiliated for for ages now. And we've had opportunities, sir. I am a lecturer by the special grace of God. I have more than 30 publications. But there is a particular one that I normally make reference to. I call it national question in Nigeria. That on, not until national question is addressed in Nigeria, there will always be a problem. There are fundamental issues. It's quite unfortunate that we have had our people there. Sorry again to say this, sir. How did this our president go to where he is? He got to where he is now by virtue of one man, the young man put him there. At the detriment of we, the Yorubas, mm. and we are now suffering. Mm. My uh, colleague, Professor, came in and said something to Chief. He said, Chief, said, I love you. <laughs> he actually said it from the depth of his heart. Mm. I love you. I love what you are doing. We need people who can tell the government of Nigeria the truth. And that is what Chisone Igbo is doing. And we are behind him. We are behind him. We are behind him. And I pray that God will continue to sustain him. Amen. God will continue to sustain him. Amen. Yes, the Triple Biblical University is a university in the United States of America. I met them a couple of years ago, and I know that they have been doing one or two things. And uh, when I was called upon to come and do this, I said, fine. And I just told our daddy, Let me, uh, maybe I should chip in that one too, it's very, very important. I just told our daddy, when I was called to come and do this, there's no way I go, I normally present whatever case to the governing council of my own school. When I did, they said, are you sure? You are going to see a whole Sunday go. I said yes. The they said, please, if you get there, tell them that we also want to honor him yeah. in a very special way. Okay. In fact, I was expecting a letter. But they did not bring us out to our brother. Maybe I'll bring the letter later. Out to our brother, they are just letter to introduce this. They said, they want to. I said, but they said, this is a school in America. We are in Africa. He's an African. And by virtue of even being in Bene, the school is in Bene, we must also honor him before he leaves. I said, I will definitely deliver your message. And again, sir, uh, I was not properly briefed of how the program will look like. If not, I would have, we would have prepared. In fact, we were supposed to be five. But probably because of today, some of them, because of one artillery or the other, they could this not. This preparation uh, is good enough. They, they, they <laughs> could not <laughs> make it. They, they could not make it. So, 
by virtue of how the program ought to be, we ought to read his citation yes. first. Yes. That we did not prepare. You could see me, I was moving up and down. But luckily, since I was told, I have been, I just went to his page, I've been studying him. I've been studying him since about a week. So that actually gave me an idea. I said, okay, I will just try and triple something down. We will definitely use that. So pardon me, sir, if I don't have a well-written message, but uh, the way I have done it, I will try and read it. So we are to read the citation of uh, Chief uh, Sunday, Ade, Ade Niyi, Ade Yemo, a.k.a. Sunday Igbo. He said, uh, Sunday Igbo Osha has risen to become a popular figure in Nigeria. He was involved in the Ife Mudakeke War and now is, a, is leading an uprising against the Fulani community in the southwestern Nigeria. Igbo became the topic of discussion in Nigeria and probably around the world. Sunday Igbo was born on a, in the year 70, in the 70s. Hail from Igbo town, Okeugun, or your state. They say he moved to live with his father, popularly called Baba Igbo, in Mudakeke area of Osho State. Igbo was made a youth leader and also one time chairman of motorcycle riders in Mudakeke. Igbo gained international recognition for, part, for the part he played in the Ife Mudakeke War between 1997 and 1998, where he helped to defend the Mudakeke people. Igbo is married to wives who currently live outside of Nigeria in different countries, precisely Canada and the and the Germany. Igbo is of Christian faith and also known as traditionalists. Most times when I read that accent, <laughs> when I read that, I know that definitely we all, you know, it, it's a long story, sir. It's a long story. Okay. I am a professor of Yoruba civilization. That is my field, okay. Yoruba civilization. And the incursion of this Western idea have actually made us to lose our focus, our roots. You are either a Christian or a Muslim. But originally, who are we? Before the incursion of this. Originally. So the traditionalist, the traditional line, this thing still remains. We cannot. It's quite unfortunate that now people don't want to be associated with tradition, tradition again. We see it. The, the word that the, 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 the white have actually put in our mouth, we see it, we say, it is fetish. But, you know, we really need to understand something. That is why I love the Indians, the Chinese. They really appreciate where they are coming from. And that is why I said, we have so much in Nigeria that we really need to address. We are still youth. This is our, our granny. You are our granny. We are seeing you. But I think if that correction can be made now, it will go a long way. Apologies, sir. The religion is one of those things that is still causing problems in Nigeria today. Religion around the world. Thank you, sir. Around the world. Religion is a major uh, this thing, problem. So it is my honor and privilege to present to you the Akoni Odua of Yoruba land. Chief right. mm. Dr. Sunday Adeniyi Adeyemo, a.k.a. Sunday Go, to be honored with the honorary doctorate degree in peace in, in war and conflict, war, conflict, and peace studies by the Tribute uh, Christian University. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.
No going back. No going back, Neil. No, after the ceremony, you can now sleep.